So what are we going to talk about today? Yeah, that's what I want to know. Okay. <laughs> This is not a happy story. Okay. But I think we have to talk. Okay. We're going to talk about a really sad incident that happened at the Tokyo Haneda Airport. Ah, yes, there was a big uh, accident on the runway at Haneda on right. January the 2nd. Is this right. the one that you're referring to? That's, that's correct. Right. So everyone knows about this. It was on the news for a very long time. Yes, yes. So uh, uh, unfortunately, five people died. Yes, five people from the Japan Coast Guard plane yes. uh, died and the pilot was uh, severely injured. And then the other plane was a JAL passenger plane. Mm -hmm. And thankfully, no one there was, was deceased. No one died. Mm. There were some injured people, but I think everyone survived. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, that was really shocking news. Very, very surprising. Yes, I was... I was uh, speechless. Yeah, uh, we were all just waiting to see what happened. We just mm -hmm. I had the TV on all night and we just kept waiting for updates all night right, long. Right. Yeah. Because, you know, I run I help run a travel group on Facebook for mm. foreigners coming to Japan. And so that affected a lot of members in our group. That affected a lot of people trying to come visit Japan and also people who were trying to leave Japan. A lot of people use Haneda Airport. Mm -hmm. um, so I was watching the live updates pretty much all night long. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. I found on a news uh -huh. related to this one. Okay. Some people might not know this. Two passengers' pets were killed during the Japan airplane crash. Oh, two pets were... I didn't hear about that, actually. Yes, I, I, I think we were list looking for the people. We didn't yes. hear about the pets. Yeah, so yeah, of course, everyone focuses on the people, yeah. but not the pets. Oh, that's too bad. Pets are uh, categorized as uh, things. As right. A J -A -L. Right, they're kind of classified as like carry-on luggage. Yes. In a way, yes. even though they're living things. So the news I watched on YouTube was saying only... Not on, maybe not only Japan, but uh, Japan has very strict rule about pets. I think a lot carrying of, yeah. pets to an uh, airplane is a prohibit. Um, are they? You mean inside the airplane inside and inside the, the the part where people ride? Yes, yes. They can go into the cargo bay. Okay, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Under the plane, like in yes. the cargo area. It's a really cold area. Yeah. Yeah, so, but people can, can carry pets inside an airplane, but it's same, not the same area. Okay. I think the American airlines are kind of loosening up on that mm. because a lot of Americans now have service animals, and these are like therapy dogs or, for example, if someone has seizures mm. or someone has a medical condition, some dogs have training where they can know that the person is going to have a problem before the, the problem happens. And mm. so a lot of people are allowed to take their service animals mm. on airplanes. But mm. I didn't know. So JL is quite strict about that. They don't allow that. Yes, that's what the reporter says on the news. Oh, okay. That's interesting. Yes. But the, uh, some other countries allowed to carry pets inside an airplane. Yes. With, I've taken my cat on the airplane. Yeah, that would be nice. It wasn't. It was <laughs> terrible. It was a very uh, difficult journey. Mm. But um, it's better than having the cat under mm -hmm. the airplane in the cargo area. So in that incident in Haneda, two pets died. So they were in the cargo area of yes. the airplane. Yes. Oh, no. So, yeah, people have no time. And then they didn't have a choice to bring these pets with them. Of course. Oh, of course not. Because uh, when they were evacuating the, the passengers from the plane, some people, you know, we were watching all this mm. on the news, and some people were asking, well, you know, what about their luggage? Mm. And some, someone else said, no, their luggage is it's all burned. Mm. Because that's where the collision happened was that area. And the luggage was all destroyed. Only the people's lives were saved. Mm. But no one at that time, no one thought about 
pets being in with the luggage you're mm. in. That's really tragic. It is tragic. Mm. It's really sad news. Mm. Yeah. So, what are your thoughts on allowing pets in the cabin during the flight? Well, you're asking an animal lover, so I'm, <laughs> I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm fine with animals in the airplane. I don't mind.、Mm. Uh, I think it'd be fine to have dogs and cats in the airplane. It doesn't bother me whatsoever.、Mm-hmm. Uh, when I took my cat on the airplane, you know, many years ago, he was in a carry case, and the carry case had to be small enough to fit under my seat. So it could be in the floor area, which meant that I had nowhere to put my own feet,、mm. which is what I did. I sat with my legs up pretty much for 14 hours. But、um, no one knew he was there.、Mm. And then he meowed once. And then the lady in the next aisle said, Oh, is that a cat? I have allergies to cats. And then she suddenly started sneezing.、Mm. But she'd been okay. Even though there was literally a cat there, she, she was okay for the first three or four hours. She didn't know there was a cat there.、Uh-huh. And then, as soon as she knew there was a cat there, then、mm. suddenly she had an allergy attack,、uh. which is a bit crazy. <laughs> <laughs> a little bit crazy.、Um, yeah. But, but so, like, you do have to consider that some people do have、allergies. cat allergies or dog allergies.、Yes. Otherwise, I'm okay with having dogs and cats in the airplane. How about、yeah. you? What do you think? Yeah. I think it's difficult, of course. Some people d o e s n t like cats and dogs. Yeah, yeah. But for a cat lover, dog lovers, we want to bring our pets inside. Yeah. So, yeah. But my, especially my pets, we have, my family have、uh, two dogs. Yes. And they are barky. They are very barky. You have very barky dogs. <laughs> so, uh, I think if we bring our dog inside an airplane, they would definitely bark at everyone. And everyone would complain. Yes. <laughs> well, honestly, though, it's no worse than people bringing children、mm. who cry the whole time.、Oh, it's、yes. kind of the same thing, right? <laughs> would you rather have a crying baby or a barking dog? <laughs>、mm, it's about the same to it's me. About <laughs> it's same. about the same. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you can't really prevent it. Right. But you know, there could be measures. For example, there could be only a certain area of the plane where the animals are kept. True,、sure. yes.、Uh, or it could be only on certain flights, like only one flight a day going、yes. from Tokyo to you know, somewhere. Yes. Yeah, like、uh, we could ask、uh, JLL to make、uh, like、a pet's priority sheet or something. Yeah. Yeah. This, only, this seat or area that people bring. Can bring a pet. Yeah. That kind of, you know, a protocol,、uh, rules、yeah. they can maybe make. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, do you think this incident will change how airlines handle pet trouble? Oh, that's a difficult question. I, I would like to say yes, but I'm going to say no. Mm. For two reasons. Number one,、yes. this is a Japanese airline. Okay. Japanese companies and Japanese people in general are notoriously resistant to change. <laughs> they don't like to change anything. Even if there's a good reason to change, they still don't like to change.、Mm-hmm. Also, the second reason is this incident didn't make top news. I think because it was maybe only two pets that died, it, it wasn't like really big news. No. And so it probably won't cause like a big splash.、Mm-hmm. Um, if, if it had happened to more pets and more people complained and more people made problems for the airline, then maybe yes.、Mm-hmm. Maybe. Yes. What do you think? Do you think it's going to change how airlines travel? With pets, how they handle pets? I don't think nothing will change. Why not?、Uh, because in the news that I watched,、uh-huh. a airplane, not a airline company, changed the, their rules. Oh? They said、uh, they can、uh, use their. Traveler can bring a pet inside an airplane. A company allowed to bring pets 
inside an airplane. Okay. Not a pet, a pet. A pet. Okay.、Mm. So I can't take like five dogs. No. I can take one dog.、Maybe. You can take a one dog. <laughs> okay, not five. But、uh, <laughs> there's a catch.、Mm-hmm. You can't take them with you when it's emergency. Emergency okay. situation. Okay. So even even like in this situation with the airplane crash, people only would be evacuated. The pets would still be left in the airplane. Exactly. So it wouldn't really change anything. Nothing Maybe. will change. Maybe. I think it's a very sad. Yeah, but I kind of understand it because the the you know your pet has to be in a box. It has to be in a carry a carry case.、Mm-hmm. Those things are hard plastic and steel.、Mm. But when people are evacuated from the airplane, they have to use like a rubber slide、mm. that's kind of inflatable.、Mm. So the the case, the carry case, would probably damage the slide or. Puncture the slide,、mm. um, so they do have to think about that too, like、right. how to get all the people out safely first. Yes, and also it's really hard to carry a, a pet case. Yeah, and、um, yeah, when it's emergency, maybe it takes a lot of time to bring them outside. Yeah. So、um, yeah, right, exactly. It, it, There's that time, the time element. Yeah. Also. yeah. Yes. Yes. You have to think about how long, like getting everyone evacuated as quickly、mm. as possible, and then if、mm. people are trying to fiddle around with pet carriers and bags and stuff, then that you know becomes very dangerous. Yes. Do you know what kind of pets died in that? Did you hear if it was a dog or a cat or? Probably dogs, but I don't know what kind of dog. Okay, I'm assuming dogs too,、mm. but one never knows. Very sad. Very、yeah. sad news. Yes.